I call the hearing of the U.S. Senate Subcommittee on Rural Development and Energy to order. One of the big challenges in rural America is access to high-quality, high-speed Internet. And one-third of rural Americans are unable to access broadband of 100 megabits per second, and you've got to have speed. That's just above average speed for most Internet users. And when our communities lack access to quality Internet, they're locked out of the global economy and cut off from critical services, and we want to change that. Workers have fewer opportunities. Farmers and small businesses are isolated from new markets, and our kids are really limited in their educational opportunities. And today, I introduced the, re, uh, uh, along with Senator Marshall, I introduced the Reconnecting Rural America uh, Act. That bill, number one, would establish 100, 100 symmetrical build-out speeds. Number two, set unserved definitions to ensure the program is reaching those who need broadband the most and not building where it's not needed. Next, expand USDA's authority to coordinate with other federal agencies. And finally, provide sufficient authorization levels to address the overwhelming demand that the program currently experiences. Teachers have remarked on the dramatic and heartbreaking difference between those that were able to continue learning and those that were not due to the lack of broadband access. And this continues as we move more and more to digital learning. The other key for most of our areas, rural areas, are the vast distances that they must travel for healthcare. This week, uh, Blue Cross Blue Shield stopped reimbursing for telephone visits, which means we must develop access to broadband and create affordability for everyone. It, it's, it's time to get the base built um, out in the rural areas, and the base is getting fiber to each and every location within the areas we serve. Over time, we'll be able to update the electronics on the fiber to bring multiple gigabit speeds to the, our customers in, in future years. No other technology right now has the future of, of, that we can provide over the fiber. So it, it, it's just now is the time to focus on fiber and, and get fiber everywhere as, as, as soon as possible. You know, the big issue here uh, that I think is a major policy question is this uh, future proofing. That's the, the, the term that we're using. But what it means to me is we can't give second class service to rural America. And I, and I think Senator Stabenow uh, really uh, used a phrase that I like good enough isn't good enough because it's good enough for today. But we don't get anywhere unless we make a commitment that good enough is what's good enough uh, for everybody. With that, I'll declare the uh, hearing over it.